All right, well, my open house starts in about 30 minutes, so I'm gonna do a full walkthrough here in Santa Clarita and South New Hall and Breckenridge Place. Really, really pretty house. Uh, built in the early 70s. Uh, I love this, I love this big pot bright red door out in front. I mean, even just standing sort of right here on the, in the, on the front patio, you can see kind of to the mountains. Really, really excellent out here. It's just, it's just ever so slightly hilly and just tons of trees and feels really nice and lush and green. It's super, super quiet here in the Happy Valley. Let's go take a look inside. So this house has uh, been recently updated and uh, four bedrooms, two and a half baths, Couple of things I like about it, as soon as you walk in, you, you can see this big living room area, excellent fireplace, big window that just brings in all that light and the greenery from outside. Uh, well, this is cool, because on one hand, you can go here to the left, and you got this really nicely updated kitchen. Um, honestly, these the, the whole cabinetry is, Pretty in pictures, but it's actually really, really nice. Like there's really cool um, handles on it. There's even some really excellent kind of backsplash tile right here. All of this looks straight back out to the backyard. It's blown out, but you can literally see mountain views back here. It's really excellent palm trees. So a little kind of extra storage, a little desk area right here, which is pretty cool. Okay, so on the other side, this, I mean, I have to love this, okay? so. You got the full, like, little bar area right here. And this goes straight out, again, big doors that go right out to the backyard. Backyard's really nice, we're gonna go take a look at that, but it's got the little wet bar thing going on. I like that. So the house is big, like I said, about 2,200 square feet, a little bit over that, actually. This is our first half bath. A little half bath right off of the, off of the main hallway. I really like it. I like the wainscoting. I like the, the black and white tiles there. Bedroom number one. Come on in. Shelving space. Again, looking out into newly updated landscaping. It's pretty cool. House kind of wraps around this way. It's really nicely separated from kind of like living and entertaining space. This is... Garage back here, big laundry room. Big garage, actually. Well, let's, go, let's go take a look at the garage, because I remember when I came out and I was like, oh, that's like really, really excellent. So, garage is big, um, but ton, ton of, like, just big storage cabinets lining both sides. So, ton of storage out here. Got all the, got the pig boards and everything ready to build a little workshop or something like that, whatever, whatever you're into. All right. Full bathroom here. Two sinks, nice and spacious. Yeah, I like this, I do. More storage built in right here. This is, this is probably the smallest bedroom. This would be guest bedroom, office, workspace, or something like that. But there's a little closet in there as well. And, I mean, I, this is, this to me, this is definitely the master. I mean, hands down. Big, big room, big space, double closets. Which would, in my case, both go to Lindsay because she has so many clothes. Um, I love you, babe. Uh... Love this shower. Kind of has this, uh, you know, they got the, the, the shower head and the, the retractable uh, little, little spot to sit down there. I like this. Rich wood on the, on the mirrors. So this is great. So this walks out. I mean, they all kind of walk out here into the back. Your... I haven't unlocked this one yet. This is harder to do one-handed than I expected. Hey, look at that, the door's open now. It's kind of like magic, it really wasn't that hard. Just, just took a little bit of finagling. <laughs> because apparently I don't know how to open screen doors. Now you gotta love this, I mean this is just absolutely fantastic. Huge, huge backyard. 
Um, I would love to see what these trees look like when, when, when winter's over. They're just gonna be fantastic. But really large space, I mean, big backyard. You don't, I mean, you don't see the, uh, this big of a space in, in a lot of the uh, tighter packed houses closer to Los Angeles. This is excellent. Got a little window right there feeding into the kitchen. And this, this is cool. I remember seeing pictures of, of this, but I didn't sort of really fully understand the entire scope. So if you come back here to this really nice red gate here, here we go. You have a huge amount of property back here. <laughs> uh, I don't know just how much is all in this area, but it's huge. I mean, already it looks like there's some, some kind of like citrus trees happening right here. Great for a garden. I guarantee you, you could put it in a pool, either here or up or down. Uh, turn it into, you know, a little gazebo dining. Um, I mean, it, the, the weather's nice up in Santa Clarita and the, well, basically any, any time outside of January. <laughs> Um, but it's still really pretty today. I'm so happy it's not like raining on me right now. So that's the whole walkthrough. Um, I'm gonna be here from two to four. Really excited for this one. Uh, the sellers recently did a price drop, so kind of gets it nice back in line to, uh, with the rest of the stuff that's happening in the neighborhood. Really hoping to get a buyer here because I think this is just an excellent property. And I'm really excited to, uh, show everybody that comes today uh, all about it. So uh, yeah, here's to an excellent, excellent open house.